Day two of our northern cruise with Captain Cook Cruises. We're here in Levuka, the first capital of Fiji. An historical town, feels like you've been transported a hundred years back here. We're doing a town tour this morning with our Protector of Paradise team and some of the team are going to a traditional bure to hear a Fijian lady tell them stories, some talanoa and have a cup of tea. Yeah, so we're heading off to a small town I think, a small historical site. On the 10th of October 1874, Fiji Islands were signed over to Queen Victoria and this is exactly the point where it happened in Levuka. Finding out the history of the first capital of Fiji. We're here at this bore which was built in 1970 for Fiji independence. When they got independence, Prince Charles came here to have a cup of tea and his first grog session with Kava in this bore where our protectors are right now. I feel like a lot of like. <laughs> The actual cannibalism story that not a lot of people know, even like here in Fiji, like an accidental thing where her direct uh, ancestor started. So it's around about 200 years, 250 years ago, maybe two months ago. <laughs> <laughs> they undug that earth oven, saw the cooked man and they said, okay, we don't really know what to do with this, we have to let the great chief know and let him deal with it. So they sliced off a piece of meat, I'm not sure which part, but they took it to the great chief and then the great chief tried it, you know, I think just out of curiosity, tried it and then he said it's the best meat he has ever had. Church. It was discovered in the 1880s by the French missionaries. You see, uh, most of the early builders that when they came to your school were boat builders. You can see the structures of the ceiling of this church. You can see some uh, French influence still around, the designs of the ceiling. Mother! Mother! Apparently we are at the police station, not that we are in any trouble, but everything around here seems to be like a, like a piece of history. My family's uh, Livorni from the Livorni village and that's used to be over the top of the mountains there, nestled in the volcano crater. They were impenetrable because they could see their enemies coming so nobody could get to them. Fierce warriors, the Livorni people. So yeah, how many steps? 199. Let's go, 199 steps. We also learned basically how to make a basket out of coconut leaf. And this basket, you put everything in it and you can make it as big as you want. You can even take this to supermarkets. You can reduce plastics by choosing more of nature. Check it out. It is pretty cool. We are 